Hello from Slovenia again. Uh, I will do something different today. Uh, I have my flower shaped cups, but you see, I have a hole and I will try to do an open cup with this. And because of this, um, how can I show you that? Because of this shape, you see, tulip shape, I hope that I will get some nice results. And I will use uh, some silicone, but um, yesterday when I did, I will just put this aside for a second, just uh, to bring my paints. I will use gold, uh, azo yellow, deep hue, phthalo blue, um, poo, nephto red, middle hue I think and um, this is uh, turquoise turquoise green turquoise so I will add one two three I did four one two three cups I did four again uh, drops of silicone in each paint and yesterday I used that treadmill silicone oil and oil and I have too much cells so today I will use my hair uh, silicone oil for hair it's a Slovenian product and it's 100% silicone oil and we have this for our hair, if our hair is dry too much, so uh, I don't know, I grabbed this light gold, but I don't know if this is good idea, we will see I will mix this good because I don't want uh, caterpillars in it. I will try to show you my consistency just in a second. See? It leaves a mound on a mound. Okay. And phthalo blue, phthalo cyan blue, and bright aqua green. I remember now. This is bright aqua green. Green. And let's see what will happen. I saw Olga from um, Smart Art Materials that she do. Maybe I should kind of find the middle because I want to spin this and I want to have this approximately in the middle. So let's see if I can do that. So my middle is kind of here. Um, so I will pour my white here in the middle. Because of course we need, and I have a ton of air bubbles. <coughs> and I am using uh, 12 by 12 inch canvas today. Maybe I should add a little more white around. So
so many air bubbles. I will try to torch this a little bit because I have a lot of air bubbles. Okay. And I will start with some yellow. some gold this gold looks so weird and some red I'm really curious how this will turn out some blue aqua green and let's add my yellow again and the gold And red and blue and turquoise. This paints aside. I will pour a little white on top of this, maybe. Okay. Really, really interesting effect. And I think that I should turn my lights on. Because it's looking weird color wise. See, it's there are beautiful colors, but you kind of can't see it so let's grab this Oop. and now I will use of course my glove and I will dip it here in the middle and then we will Torch this a little bit and spin. I just don't want this. Blob of white here. And I still get it on this side, so. And still. I just don't do this okay I will go here because I think that I have to do it like this okay and now I dripped I will leave it because otherwise I will just do a bigger mess I think maybe I can maybe I should even do this in the first place just bring this paint from kind of patterns here 
petals here to the middle and not dip it but this is the first try so I really didn't know what will happen so I will just whoops something I will just add some white around here and try to wet this down just a little bit but it will spin easier maybe and I didn't have any paint almost here I have enough paint to cover this canvas <clears throat> so let's see beautiful cell city <laughs> so let's see what will happen just a second that I bring you like this maybe I think that I made a mistake with this uh, white on top because now I have this white here in the middle that I don't necessarily like and probably I should just uh, leave uh, that uh, you know uh, when I dip with the glove I think that I should just do it without a glove I will just Add a little paint here on the corners. This one is done. Here I need a little of this white and yellow just to try to match, but it's not so important here <laughs> and then I will take it down for a close-up I will towards this a little bit to bring some cells here on the corners too that it will match a little more maybe because I don't have any white left So I hope that if I were torch this that it will be better. I will just try to add a little as I have just a touch of white here left. So I want to do this corner because it's it was kind of weird 
let's torch my corners a little bit. just wanted a little of these tiny cells but now the cells inside the cells starts popping up um, so what I learned is that I probably shouldn't have uh, add white and on the, on the top of the paints I should have left my turquoise <coughs> turquoise one I think uh, and I'm not sure about this gold it gives kind of metallic look to some Just didn't like this weird greenish color here. I prefer these cells. Um, but otherwise, it's really interesting. So I will just try to play with this <laughs> torching part a little bit uh, so I will definitely use this technique again uh, maybe a little less silicone because uh, I don't know about this whole um, Uh, I'm just thinking what to do with this white here, but I can't save this now. Uh, so, no white at the end, a little less silicone maybe. Uh, But otherwise, it's quite interesting because it looks like a mosaic flower, kind of. You see? Uh, you get this flower shape with this, the cells. So I'm quite impressed with this outcome. I didn't mean that it will work like this, you see, this is the part that bothers me the most. Because all of this white here in the middle, so probably I shouldn't, uh, or I shouldn't have dip, dip, dip uh, a glove. Maybe if I would just leave that white and um, bring this kind of petals towards the middle and spin it would be okay but cells are beautiful I did some mistakes with the torching here because I get the cells inside the cells that I not crazy about uh, See that this Jamaica kind of uh, 
not Jamaica, <laughs> I don't know which country has a, a flag in these colors. So tell me what you think. I definitely shouldn't have torched anymore, but I was thinking to get some, I don't know, get rid of some of this white, but I couldn't. I love these multicolored cells and the rings around, you see. And I like a little ones that are around and I know that uh, if you look it from uh, the distance didn't look like something but when you come closer you see almost like a mosaic flower and kind of like it. Maybe uh, I shouldn't have started with uh, yellow but otherwise it's gorgeous. Tell me what you think. Do you want to see more of this technique? see what will happen with these open cups maybe we can do some dirty pour because this time I layered paints and I have quite a bit paints left so maybe I will do another one so this is it for today and see you on the next one bye